Let's take a look at dividing on TI-34 multi-view, dividing fractions specifically, I should say. We've got 30 over 8 divided by 12 over 16. We're going to type this in exactly as we see it. So I'm going to do my fraction button. And i got 30 over 8. So 30, and then I'll down arrow to 8. And then right arrow. And then I'll do my divide. And then I'll put my N over D button again to put a fraction. Then we've got 12 over 16. So I'll do 12 down arrow and put in 16. Now right arrow. And uh, it looks exactly like what we have on paper. If I press Enter then we get 5. Now this is a little bit different uh, than the, what we saw with multiplication. With multiplication, uh, we know with division you would have flipped the second fraction, multiplied the top parts together, multiplied the bottom parts together, and uh, you'd think that the designers would have programmed this the same way, and that you kept doing a simplify to um, simplify it. But uh, for whatever reason they didn't do that. Now the question becomes, well, what if I put in something different? Will it make me simplify it? Well, let's see. I do N over D. Let me do 30. I don't know the answer to this myself, so we're, I'm learning. And then 12. I'm definitely not an expert on this calculator. I'm just creating this for, for my students. I do use it. And then um, do my fraction again. And let's put 20. And then I'll put it over um, 25. Right arrow. Press Enter. And uh, interesting. It um, put it into mixed number form and also needs to be simplified. Well, if I push my simplify button now and then push enter, you, it tell, you can see that top and bottom are both divisible by 2. And it tells you that. Factor is 2. If I do simplify again and press enter, top and bottom are both divisible by 3. So you get 5 fortieths. And that arrow means more. So I can do simplify. And we get 3 and 1 8. And there's not an arrow anymore, so that's as, as simplified as it gets. But it is in mixed number form. And typically in algebra, we don't like mixed numbers. Well, we got a form here. You see above this um, U, N over D button? It, uh, this will allows us to go back and forth between improper fraction form and mixed number form. So if I do second and then that button, and then push Enter, you see it gives us our 25 over 8. Now you can freehand type in... Um, this problem, but you want to make sure you put parentheses around each fraction when you do that. So if I do a beginning parentheses, 30 divided by 8, closing parentheses, divided by beginning parentheses, 12 over 16, closing parentheses, and then press enter, then we get the right answer. If you do not put the parentheses around each individual fraction on division when you write type in freehand, you will not get the right answer. Maybe some real rare occasions you would, but not very often. 30 divided by 8, that's our first fraction, then divided by our second fraction, which is 12 over 16. So I do 12 divided by 16, and push enter, and you see we got a decimal, and to change that fraction, we do our second n over d, and press enter. And we get uh, we don't get the correct answer. The answer should have been five. So again, if you're going to freehand type it in like that, put parentheses around each fraction when you plug it in. Now this was dividing uh, fractions on a TI-34 multi-view.